Carlo, IT support guy here. So, the big boss emailed you personally and asked for an urgent favor, which involves sharing sensitive information, and you did it? <coughs> Today, I want to talk about CEO fraud. It's a sneaky phishing technique that hackers use to trick you into giving up your company's sensitive data or money. Hackers so creative, I clap for you. So, how do they do this? Why do they do this? In fact, who are these people? First, the why. Greedy ma. Who are these people? Again, greedy people, fraudsters, hackers. But it's not just about money. They may also try to steal your company's sensitive data. So, how do they do it? Well, as companies spend time, effort, and a load of money on cybersecurity infrastructure, fraudsters have decided to target the weakest link. Us! They have already tricked so many people with basic phishing techniques, such as making you click on a link that gives them access to your device or network. How many people do you know have opened an attachment that they later find out is malware? Some process just directly ask for login details and personal information. And unfortunately, people actually give it away. With CEO from hackers impersonate your big bosses to trick you into triggering unauthorized transfers of money or sharing of sensitive data. Why do people fall for this? Well, imagine you get a personal text or email from someone who says they're the CEO of your company. Stress, right? The fraudsters can be so good at impersonating your big boss that you will not know the difference. They then create a sense of urgency in their email, asking for something to be done so quickly that the poor employee might not verify the request. Fraudsters also pick their targets very carefully. They will usually pick employees who are more likely to receive communications from senior management. We all have bosses, right? So everybody beware. CEO fraud can be easy to spot if you know what to look for. The request will almost always be related to money. For example, someone claiming to be senior management contacts you with a request to send money to a certain account. They will try to justify it in a few ways, paying a supply invoice, paying a bill for a trip, or some other reason that may allow an unscheduled, unauthorized transfer. If you get such a request, take a breath and think before you click. Look out for all the usual signs of phishing. Check the address to see if the sender is actually who they claim to be. Look out for things like strange spellings of people's names and even the company URL. It may look almost the same as your actual boss's email and company with just a few characters out of place. Don't click on any links or open any attachments if you're unsure of their origin. Report the phishing email to your IT department and let your supervisor know. So yeah, CEO fraud is a real threat to our IT systems and personal data. The fraudsters are getting sneakier every day, so let's all be cyber smart.